So there is a new AI technology that is able to convert a picture into a realistic and detailed 3D model and it is called Direct 3D S2. So this technology will be released as an open source model and the code will be released on May 30th, 2025. Right now I'm recording this video on May 29th so it's really just one day away and I'm going to leave the link in the video description if you want to maybe get and download this model on your computer but there is a way to just try this model for free via a web browser. However, before I show you how you can use this new technology to convert a picture into a 3D object, I'll show you a few, a few pictures or a few examples that were created on this technology. So this is the original picture and this is the generation on trellis, Hunyuan 2.0, 3.SG, High 3 Gen, and, sorry, High 3D Gen, and then this is the one from Direct 3D S2. And as you can see, if you look closely at the details, this one is definitely a lot better. So that's on this picture, this picture, this picture, and this picture. So overall, if you look closely, I'm going to leave the link, by the way, so you can compare it yourself. But it's much more detailed, and it's way better than other models right now. And keep in mind that this is open source, so there could be some platforms or products out there incorporating this technology into their product. Now, if you want to use this new technology to convert a picture into a 3D model that later you can use for other projects, you can navigate to this page. So again, I'm going to leave this demo link in the video description. So basically, you have to provide a picture. It could be any picture. And what's unique about it is that there is a feature that will isolate the main subject of the picture. For example, here, I uploaded a picture of this car and it isolates everything, just remove the background and leaving only the car and I click generate. And by the way, you can select the resolution between 512 and 1024. And after that, you can click generate and it will create a 3D object of that picture. So even though it is only see the front, uh, the front of the car, it is able to guess or accurately guess what the side and behind the car. So I would say the back is not exactly, you know, detailed, but the front is actually pretty good. And I think for game developers, for 3D designers, it's not going to be something that they can use right away. But it is always nice to have some initial draft that was created by AI. So you can navigate to this page, you can upload a picture, and then it will isolate the picture, and then you can convert it into a 3D object. So uh, that's basically it. I'm going to leave all the resources in the video description so you can give it a try. Anyway, if you find this video to be useful, then feel free to subscribe to this channel and I'll see you on my next video.